Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome on back to another reaction video. If you have no idea who I am, my name is Sam, aka the OG Bojangles. I'm a first time movie reactor here on YouTube, posting every Tuesday and Friday, and I'm also a streamer over on Twitch. For today's video, I'm watching a movie that, yet again, a lot of people have been wanting me to watch. Probably, apparently, because it's sad, but also it's very well done. Today, I am watching The Color Purple from 1985. As with any movie I watch on this channel, I have absolutely no idea what's gonna happen, but I am cautiously excited <laughs> to watch. And I say cautiously because, uh, again, apparently this movie is going to make me cry. So it's probably going to happen and I accept that fate. <laughs> So I guess with that, let's get started. If you're here watching this right now, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching. And to those of you over on Patreon, thank you so much for being there. Thank you so very much for your support. And I hope you're enjoying all the full unedited reaction videos and the access to the polls. If you want to watch the full unedited version of this video or to anything else on my channel, you can absolutely do so over on my Patreon. It is $5 a month for that. I also have a tier over there that is solely for the polls and that is $2 a month for that. So yeah, let's get on into it really do hope you guys like this reaction to the color purple and i shall see you on the other side enjoy wow she looks so see, young to be you got the ugliest smile this side of creation oh <laughs> That was rude as hell! I was about to say though, she looks so young to be pregnant. Ain't you done yet? Oh, no, no, no. Wow. A girl. I can't believe he was like, are you done yet? Are you done pushing that human being out of your... No, no. What are you gonna do with the baby? Dear God. I'm 14 years old. Oh. I got two children by my daddy. A baby boy called Adam and a baby girl called Olivia. They took right out my arms. Uh, did, did she just say that she had her dad's kids? Oh, it's terrible. She's 14. Also incest. I see him looking at my little sister. She's scared, but I say, I'll take care of you. Mm -mm. With God help. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. He come home with a girl from around a town called Gray. She be almost my age, but they can't marry now. Oh my God. What is going on? <laughs> these young, young, young girls getting married to these older men. I know that's like, no, it's, it's in history, yes, but it's still disturbing. It always will be disturbing. Also, the incestuous stuff. Oh, man. I want to marry you, Nettie. Oh, Lord almighty. I got nobody to watch over my younger. I can let you have Celie. She's spoiled. Twice. Celie is ugly, but she ain't no stranger to hard work, and she can learn. Oh, my you God. Know? Mr. One, I'm looking this you. is so messed up. Poor girl. He said Over. she's spoiled. She's ugly. Spoiled as in like she had two babies, so she's spoiled. <laughs> this here, your new mammy. She ain't my mammy. <laughs> oh my God, she got. Oh, they chucked the rock at her. Oh, good lord. What is with? Oh my god. Oh. This poor girl. Holy shit. Oh, this these walls are caked in dirt. How did that happen? Or smoke maybe? Or is it like a smoke? Oh my god. Wow, she did a fantastic job. Carpool. Didn't I tell you to clean my fabric? Not putting your dirty ass shoes on there. Ow. Ow. Shut up! Ow. I can't, it hurts Ow. her. Oh no. Don't talk back to me. I wish I could time travel. Just beat the. Bop, bop. Oh, oh, that's so infuriating. It's so infuriating to watch movies like this where shit like this was like the norm. Oh my god. 
Watch your head now. God, this girl, again, so so young, and she's had two children. Oh! <laughs> I think she mine. My heart says she mine. But I don't know she mine. Is she my baby? Her name Olivia. What's her name? Pauline. Well, but I call her Olivia. Oh! You gonna buy anything or not, Gail? Oh, my God. Sir, you need to back it up. All right. There's already like eight people I want to just in the face, you know, a little bit. Hey, you know what? As much as I say I want to, you know, punch people, I've never punched a person in my life. But these people, mm, 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 I'm that. Mm. <laughs> Anybody who is being bleh, in this movie so far, I'm a fighter now. I just couldn't keep him off me. Think I could stay here with you, huh? Um, well. Oh no. I would not. Not with this man. She be kin now. So what happened with you and Pa? Hey. I just couldn't keep him off me. Oh. He tried everything. Oh. You know how he is. Oh. I ain't never going back there. Uh-uh. You hear what I say? I die first, see? Y'all just gotta run away together, right? I don't know. Y'all, y'all need to book it. Oh no, not this man. Oh, um, please go away. Iron, I R O N I, iron. Oh, she's smart too. So. Now it's never be apart. Oh, these poor girls. Oh, my heart <laughs> hurts. This is terrible. <laughs> I've got to go. Her the hell go, what you weirdo you mother f No, no. no. Ah. Go, 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 run, 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 run. Good, good, good. Oh my goodness. Leave her alone! Jeez! Ah! Nothing but death can keep me from it! Oh no! I swear to God. <laughs> she dies. <laughs> My shield gonna be here and everything gonna be the way it should be. Do it. On, girl, do, it. do it. Do it. Slit his throat. You cut me and I'll kill you. Do it. Oh. Man. Oh, is it going to be a letter from her? Can I see if I let a cup of Natty? Ain't nothing for you, here. This guy's just absolutely terrible. Eight years or so later? And so, yeah, it's it's seven seven or eight years later. That's insane. Wow. Mm -hmm. Which one? The black one or the blue one? I like the black one. <laughs> wow. Still a dick, I see. Oh, please fall down the stairs. So he's still seeing the same performer for nine years, doing the same thing. Oh wow! Surprised that's still a uh, still around. She thinks she's right, but she never right. She said only death could keep her from it, and did she dare? No. I see them coming way up the road. They just be marching, like going to war. <laughs> Silly, give me some lemonade. Young women God, no good these days. Got their legs open for every Tom, Dick, and Harper. Oh my God. I can take care of my baby all oh by my myself for oh a nice visit. No, you stay right here, Harper. When you free, me and the baby be waiting. Good for her? Just don't make me wait too long, Harpo. Oh my. Harpo! I won't. I will. I will. I do. 
God, this is this is a lot, right? <laughs> the structure of everything is That man has never hugged someone in his entire life. Oh. Oh. I like these girls. Hell yeah. Being a thing too much of a sale. Needs to be taken down a peg or two. Oh my lord. Do not listen to the man who has abused pretty much everything he came across in his entire life. Oh, I need something to eat. Pies in the pantry, just like oh. women need long. Ain't you gonna get it for me? Is there something the matter with you? Make yourself useful, Harper. Good for her. Absolutely. What I'm gonna do about Sophia? Beat her. Oh. Oh no. Ah. Uh. uh. She's not gonna take that you shit. Told Harpo to <gasps> beat me. Clyde and Norfield oh, and the shit. mule just went crazy. I love Harpo. God knows I do. But I kill him dead for I let him beat me. And yeah. that's a hoofprint. I, you know, I know that she's just kind of so ingrained with that way of life to her, you know? Oh, man. And then one day, Sophia, she just can't take it no more. In good riddance. Wow. Oh man. God, that's so sad. It's sad because he was just so, you know, he was raised that way and he thought that he was, he needed to do that. Um. Oh, who this? The woman that should have been your mammy. Should Avery? Oh my God! Did he like kidnap her? What in the what? Uh, uh, wh why did he take her? What? You show is ugly. <laughs> Damn! What the hell? What's the matter with you? You crazy? Um, maybe she's sick or something. Get that thing to make me something to eat. No, no. I'll make it myself. Ah, shit! Idiot. Man has never cut a single anything in his life. She's she's loving this. Still ain't tough enough. What is wrong with you? I mean, a lot, but you know what I mean. Like, what are you doing? <gasps> um, you're gonna set the entire house on fire. Idiot. You are literally okay. Baby, if I got a surprise for you. Now, this will make you I got burnt biscuits, burnt butter, burnt plate. Absolutely hilarious how this man has been such a hard ass, a creepy, gross hard ass this entire time. And all of a sudden it's just like this woman has him by the damn the damn throat in terms of he can't, you know, get over her. And he is just like putty in her hands. Oh my God, look at that. Oh, that looks good. Oh God, I love homemade biscuits. Oh! Yeah, yours won't be thrown like that. Don't you worry. <laughs> Empty, yep. Ate it all up. But man, she's an asshole too. She was, she walked right in. She's like, man, you're ugly. Like, what is wrong with people? Yo, Paul love you. Eh. My Paul love me. Mm. Except you don't know it. What is it with this sugar, Avery? She black as tall, nappy headed, got legs like baseball bats. What else? Old Mister talking trash about sugar. Even... Plus, I hear all our children's got different daddies. <laughs> Next time he come, I put a little sugar Avery pee in his glass oh. and see how he like that. <laughs> She's great. Poor girl, traumatized to hell, but jeez, oh, years keep going on. Hey, what y'all doing? 
Tell the Duke, John. Way back here? Uh. Yeah. Well, I drink your bath water. <laughs> Looks like Albert brought his mate. Last time I saw that kind of hat was at my mama's funeral. Oh my god. Why are people so mean to her? Why, especially like why women are so mean to her? Everyone's terrible. The song I'm about to sing is called Miss Seeley's Blues. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, we need someone to. <laughs> we need someone to be nice to her. Mm. Well, that was nice of her to make a song about her. She's actually warmed up to her now. Ha! Good for you. Lord have mercy. Ah! Oh. Not him. Oh my goodness gracious. I'm gonna need to be at home. Hey. Yeah, he keeps trying to my put up that act. Love her and take her where she wanna go. Ain't that right, babe? And That's good for you. Baby. Real men treat their women correctly. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I mean he keeps kind of playing up that act that oh yeah, I gotta totally treat my wife like shit act in front of his dad, unshockingly. Him trying to keep that act up with his father cost him his marriage. He was happy. He was fine. They were perfectly fine. And he, his history with how he treated women and his just attitude overall ruined it for him. And unfortunately, Celie did not help with her comment of, you know, hit, hit her. So. You're just a big old heifer. <laughs> like I said, fine with me. Oh man! What time to go? <laughs> time to go. That was incorrect. Everybody's like, toodaloo. <laughs> Knocked into next week. Oh my god. Get off my boy. Oh my, oh my god. Now everybody's fighting. Ah! It's so funny when these things happen because like it starts out with two people and then you got everybody in the joint hitting each other for no reason. It's like fight, fight. Good Lord. Look at her, she's smiling away. She's like, I want to watch, I want to watch. <laughs> oh, she loves the drama. It's so funny. Oh, Miss Seeley, why are you always covering up your smile? A lifelong time of abuse. Made him a snout just as long as red. I'm glad she has warmed up to her, you know? <laughs> so sad that that's like the first time we heard her like laugh like that, you know? He beat me when you ain't here. He beat me for not being you. So sad. I know he a bully. A bully? He's an abusive piece of shit. Oh my. <laughs> She's like, wait a minute. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well. Hmm. That was She's cute. Like honey. And now I, I was just like a bee. Uh-oh. Let's <laughs> follow her everywhere. That was cute. Their little interaction. Wow. Luke says she going back to Memphis. I'm gonna go with her. Oh! This is my only chance to break from Mr. Jail. Good. Yes. Good. Oh, please get out of there. Please. What you oh, doing? Oh, no. Ay, ay, ay. Was well, something you got to say, Miss Seeley? I was gonna miss you. <laughs> I was gonna miss you too, Miss Seeley. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna miss you too, baby. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, my lord. Poor girl, honestly. So can you give me some sugar? What are you doing? Your children are so clean. Would you like to work for me? Be my maid? Hell no. Ha! Ah, get fucked. What did you say? Hell. Hell no. 
What did she say? Absolutely hell yes. Oh my god. No, it's so fair, no! Good. You know what? Good. Oh, maybe not good because. Help, help me. Help me. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. He deserved the punch in the face, but. 1930? Oh, come on. No. What in the world? She ended up being Miss Millie made after all. Oh! They bought Miss Millie a new car. And she done asked Sophia to teach her how to drive it. I'm gonna drive you home tomorrow. You had not seen the children in a while, have you? Yeah, really, yeah, I wonder why. No, I ain't seen them about eight years. Oh my God, my heart. You can stay all day. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for your kindness. I will drive myself back. <laughs> well, I hope you don't get into a really tragic accident or anything. God, I just, I hope not. I'm very pleased to meet you. That's so sad. That's your mom! Oh my god! Look at her, she's like, haha, look, I did good. Ugh, I know she thinks that. I don't know y'all no more. Oh. No. No. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh good no. lord. No. <laughs> Stop the damn car. You're going to get yourself killed or someone else. <laughs> Millie. Those boys tried to attack me. No, no, no such a thing. Come on. I could you leave me alone. So oh. 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 Jack will drive you home, Miss Millie. He drives you home. I keep riding a car with some strange card man. You are gonna take this woman away. I'll ask Master So doesn't squeeze in. I don't know her either. I am infuriated. I am so mad about that. I like, I almost paused. That's how mad I am. Hey, sh Wow. Oh, oh, oh Miss Seely. I've heard so much about you. Feels uh -oh. like we old friends. Uh-oh. This my husband. Uh, oh man, both of them were disappointed. I mean, I know for a fact that letters have been continuously sent all these years. It definitely has those letters from her sister have been sent, but he just, you know, hid them or something. Come on, Miss Haley, go upstairs with me. I bet it's the letter from the sister. Good. See, she's been alive and she has been sending letters did that say africa on it is she actually wait i like am I, did I completely read that wrong the i could sword said it and said that oh man no i've been writing to you over the years but albert said you'd never hear from me again and since i never heard from you all this time i guess he was right no it's a miracle isn't it and no doubt impossible for you to believe over the damn animal with it. No. No. Oh, no. 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 What are they looking for? Oh, maybe all the letters? I wonder if he kept them. That's a big, oh my God, that is a huge, huge, huge mouse trap. It was a rat trap. Oh, 
Take that money, run. Take that money, run. Take that money, run. She's not looking at the money, but I'm looking at the money, and you should take that money and run. So many letters. I wrote, I wrote a, a letter, letter to you almost, almost every day on this ship. Wow. So it was. It was Africa that I did read. The white man is building a road, and it finally reached the cassava fields about nine months ago, right through the village of Alinka. Oh, no. But the worst is yet to be told. Great. Sweet Corrie died from fever and grief. Oh, no. And we buried her in the Olinka way. But Celie, my dear, sweet sister, we'll all be coming home soon if we can work something out with the United States immigration. Oh, man. What's gotten into you? I'm calling you for an hour. Now get in my shave and don't keep me waiting. Fixing to shave him, huh? Hmm. Here we are again. Blade and all. Can we... <laughs> Am I really getting my hopes up for this? Probably. Uh-oh, I think she knows! <laughs> Oh. Oh. That razor looks dull to me, Miss Seeley. No. Should have let her do it. No. It's time for us to go. Seeley is coming with us. Say what? Over my dead body. Okay. Well. I'm satisfied. That's what you want. You a low down dirty dog. That's what's wrong. Oh! It's time for me to get away from you. It's been and time. Creation. And your dead body be just the welcome mat I need. You oh. can't talk to my boy that way. That was his dad then, okay. Boy. Seemed like if he hadn't been your boy, he might have made somebody a halfway decent man. Oh! Well, you what? Beat his ass in with words. Canadian, my kids, they coming home soon. And when we all get together, we gonna sit around and up your ass. Amen to that. I want to thank you, Miss Seeley, for everything you've done for me. I remember that day I was in the store, Miss Miller, and when I see you, I know days are gone, and one day I was going to get to come home. Wow. You're not getting one penny of my money, not one thin dime. Did I ever ask you for anything? I don't Did I ever know. ask you for anything? I never asked you for nothing, not even your sorry ass hand in marriage. Nothing. I never asked you for nothing. I love her cracking. Any more letters come? Who's to say? Seely, no! Yes! Don't do it, Miss Seely. Do it. Don't trade places with what I've been through. Fair, but still. He ain't worth it. Oh, it's so tempting, though. Oh, my God. You're black, you're poor, you're ugly, you're a woman, you're nothing at all. Everything you even think about going to fail. It's been a pleasure meeting all of you. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> this guy is kind of cool. He's just like, yeah, we're going to leave. Peace out, loser. I'm poor, black. I may even be ugly, but dear God... I'm here. I'm here. Hey, you'll be back. No. Why would she ever come back? About time she got out of that damn house. Oh my god. This house is a wreck. And what you doing about it? Nothing. Nothing. Just sitting here drinking. I know just what you need. I need you a woman. Nice little young girl, clean up the house, iron your shirts. Said bye, Paul. Now you listen to what I tell you. Don't fix yourself. Get yourself a young little girl to fix it for you. Thoughts? After all these years, the man I knew as my pa is dead. And Eddie Wright that my real daddy lived. My mama married this dead man two years after my real daddy dead. My children, not my sister and brother. And pa, not pa. You his wife? How'd he die? On top of me. Oh my God, how messed up. 
All of it. Everything that was just said in the last 20 seconds wasn't actually her father. And that, once again, young girl died on top of her. Nice. God. And she's back where she started. Me and Shug, I smile, but I'm still longing. I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. No matter what happens to this man, I will not feel bad for him because he is terrible. Straight up, don't even care. No, no feelings of sympathy for him. <laughs> I guess I didn't quite understand why the relationship wasn't great. See, Daddy, sinners have sorrow too. I guess because she was a sinner. Yay! It's all she wanted. Oh man! Is he going to do something nice for once or is he still going to be, let's see. Reunited at last. Oh, yay. I feel like she didn't age a day. Damn. Oh my goodness. Yay, good. Yay, oh, good. Oh, this is your son. Wow. Mama. Oh, my goodness. He says, This is the day of his dream. No. Mama. No, that's so nice. No. Thanks for trying to make things right by the end, but I'm still not happy with you! You're still a dick. I am just happy for Celie. Oh. And her sister and her family and literally everybody else. No! I mean, yes, because it ended good. It ended... Oh, my heart hurts. My heart hurts. No. Oh. <sighs> Yay, we got a happy ending. Good. Woo! Okay. Holding it back a little. We're good. Everything's okay. I'm fine. My heart. Stop it. <laughs> my heart. <laughs> I'm just glad that it ended on a good note. Nobody deserves, right? Nobody deserves anything of what, you know, especially Celie went through, right? Nobody deserves that ever. Not even a little bit. And then Sophia, she went through her own shit. God, it was, it was just so much, right? It was just so much pain. And so much suffering. And it was so hard to watch in that way. Absolutely just heartbreaking at s s during so many points. And again, just super incredibly anger inducing. And oh my god, like the amount of people I wanted to punch in the face. Despite all of the <laughs> sad and just like heartbreaking moments and the anger inducing moments. This was really well done. It was a really good watch and it was just it was it was just so emotional and you just from beginning to end it was just really just pounding at you. But it was a great story just unraveled before you and overall it really was a good watch. Once again, this movie was just this roller coaster of up and down and from start to finish it told an amazing story that just unraveled before us and by amazing i mean just absolutely just emotional and depressing honestly it was depressing and i guess that's what i mean when i say amazing because it was just this story that was just so intense with emotions and 
it, again it was just it was anger inducing and it was hard to watch and hard to kind of just comprehend but it was also still a story of just people's lives unraveling before you and it could have gone literally any way. Celie's story and Sophia's story, those were definitely probably just the hardest to watch. I mean, Celie's story was from start to finish. She was the main character. And, you know, of course, just watching her crack at the dinner table in that one scene was just really fulfilling in some ways because you just kind of wanted her to crack the entire time. I certainly did. I mean, hell, I was all like, you could stab him in the neck with the with the razor like every time it came up, the when it came up towards the beginning and when it came, came up again towards the end. So I wanted that man dead. That didn't happen, which I mean, okay, fine. I should have known that it wasn't going to considering the flow of the story and everything. Uh, throwing in a kill probably didn't fit really the theme, but you know, I, a girl can dream, right? But at the very least, we got that confrontation at the table of her just snapping and her just realizing, holy shit, I put up with this for God knows how long at this point. And you know, just really just giving it to Albert because God, he deserved so much more than that. So much more. And I'm glad that the movie ended with that reuniting of basically everybody that she loves, even though she hasn't seen, you know, everybody that she met up with at the end, her children and her sister in years. And then with Sophia, like, God, I mean... <sighs> I was angry with Celie and how Albert treated her and everything, but oh my god! Oh! The whole thing with Sophia and, you know, yes, definitely you can't be punching people in the face, especially, unfortunately, you know, a white guy and you're a black woman in the 1920s, 30s, like, of course that's not going to end well for you, even though he absolutely deserved it. Still, just like that whole situation, just her being thrown in jail for, I mean, what, it was like seven, eight years and her eye got messed up and her, she was limping, like, she got messed up in jail and that's just so sad because she was just this spunky spry woman who didn't take any shit and it i loved seeing that honestly and then the whole thing and i think probably the thing that pissed me off and you guys saw it the whole thing with that woman i don't even want to remember her name because this pissed me off so much and her driving and how this poor woman Sophia didn't see her children or her family for it was it was eight years and she had the audacity and of course she did this on purpose of course she did she had the audacity to make a fool of herself driving and start to claim that these guys are attacking her and blah 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 I treated you people well shut up and then that whole thing where she's just like, well, I can't drive and I don't know anybody. They're all strangers to me. So you should, you know, drive back with me. And oh my God, she took that woman away from her family that she hadn't seen in eight years because she's a dumb bitch. Like, that's literally what it comes down to. She is a fucking absolute that pissed me off. Clearly, it pissed me off. Like, she knew exactly what she was doing and she didn't care and she is just a rotten, rotten, rotten person. And that was, again, probably one of the more anger-inducing moments that I experienced uh, in any movie that I've watched. And I've had my moments of anger. This was definitely up there. And again, I'm just gonna say it once again, I have no sympathy for Albert literally whatsoever. I don't care. I do not care that he helped Salee get her sister and her children back with immigration and everything that you know scored a point with him but all of the the years the decades of abuse and neglect and just absolute like just just manipulation and gaslighting and everything it's like absolutely hell no am i gonna have any sympathy for him whatsoever never no i don't care when you 
tear someone down for literally decades physically and emotionally and man mentally manipulating them abusing them i don't give a fuck what you do i would never have any sort of sympathy or anything with you like i will never feel bad for you if you are suffering yourself or like anything like that no it's off the table for me no <laughs> I'm sure there are some people who watch this and kind of towards the end were just like, oh, you know, he's an older man now. He he probably regrets his decisions and, you know, he helped Celie and her family out. No, absolutely not. No, that is not me. No, I am giving my sympathy to Celie. I'm giving my sympathy to Sophia. I'm giving my happiness to them and the entire family towards the end i'm giving all of that positive feeling to them because they deserve it not the grouchy abusive manipulative old man that you know scored a single point by helping out just you know just a little bit no and along with everything that i did say i am happy that suge did not turn out to be someone who was just bitter and terrible as well to silly she started out that way but she, there was something off with her i'm not i can't quite put my finger on it right now but she was like ill or she i don't even know like she maybe she was just like drunk or or she was a drunk or she was like a drug addict or something like something was not good with her like at all and you know silly took her time and she helped her even though right away he should walk walked in and said that she was she was ugly like that i don't know like <sighs> but i personally am very happy that she you know decided to be a good person which is great and i think honestly i feel like she just kind of like got better throughout the entire movie i mean they're her and Celie's like little interaction with like the the kissing and everything like i think that was just sweet and honestly just like a very cute sort of moment uh of just just love i think you know it was a nice just like tender scene that i'm glad that they had in this actually but yeah i feel terrible for Celie and sophia but i am again just happy because at the end they were much better but yeah there's definitely a lot to say about this film there's definitely a lot that happened a lot of story a lot of emotions a lot of just everything but overall it was a really good film i did really enjoy it and i hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction if you did enjoy this video please feel free to like it and if you aren't already please feel free to subscribe and if you wanted to watch the full edited version of this movie or to anything else on my channel you can absolutely do so over on my patreon it is five dollars a month for that and to those of you who are already on patreon i really do appreciate you guys over there thank you so much for being there thank you so much for your support and i hope you're enjoying all the full unedited reaction videos and the access to the polls if you wanted to find me outside of youtube you can absolutely do so you can find me pretty much anywhere at the og bojangles twitter instagram tiktok all that good stuff but i'm mainly over on twitch and streaming over there once again this was a roller coaster of emotion right from the start of it right to the finish of it from anger to sadness to more anger to more sadness to those happy moments that just accumulated at the end. This was a very good film and I completely understand why people advocate for this movie to be seen even more. Really do hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction and I hope to see you all in the next video, whatever that may be. Okie dokie, toodaloo, adios, and goodbye. Oh!